Stand by. I'm initiating an uplink to bring your systems online one at a time. Health, online. Shields, online. Tracker, online. Targeting, online. There's a calibration glitch in the targeting systems. I need you to direct your reticule to each of the red lights. Some Pacific City roads and freeways may be impaired or impassable. Please, drive carefully. If you see the telltale signs of freak infection, don't panic. Report okay, you've got it. Let's move on. Agent, I want you to jump off the ledge in front of you. Think of this as an exercise in trust. Take care of the rest. <laughs> nice landing. Sure, you took a hit, but that drop would have killed a normal man. The good news is your regenerative systems are working fine, and you'll be back to full health in no time. Time to assess your athletic capabilities. Collect that orb at the top of the steps. That shouldn't prove too great a challenge to someone of your caliber. Good. These orbs boost your agility skill. Collect more to leap higher and farther. Now, to complete this program, you must leave the room. Climb up to the marker. Standing on that marker triggered the exit to open. Now, all you need to do is make it through the door before it shuts. That was tolerable. Let's just chalk that one up to the first night nerve, shall we? Follow the path to the firing range and take the weapon provided. Handling weaponry should be second nature to you. The ordnance you now hold is a standard issue agency assault rifle. Use it to kill the freak without assisted targeting. Don't worry, this freak won't fight back. Use precision targeting to shoot the freak's head or legs. Come on, this should be child's play for you. Use precision targeting to shoot the freak's head or legs. Come on, this should be child's play for you. Come on, this should be child's play for you. Come on, this should be child's play for you. Reload your weapon. Use precision targeting to shoot the freak's head or legs. Come on. Come 
come on. This should be child play for you. Use precision targeting to shoot the freak's head or legs. Nice shooting. Now pick up the agency shotgun. I'm releasing more freaks to help assess your survival instincts. Engage them with zero tolerance. Now, follow the trail to the next zone. The next program tests your close quarters combat skills. Use a basic attack to engage the sparring partner provided. Good. Try repeatedly attacking to chain moves. As you get stronger, you can wield objects as weapons. You won't always be engaged in one-on-one -on -one combat. So let's see how you cope with a few more targets. Explosives. Get those grenades. Explosives are a convenient means of dispatching multiple targets. Use your grenades to blow these freaks to pieces. Let's move on. Agent, follow the trail and get in the vehicle provided. Impressive. You're the first new gen clone to make it through these diagnostic programs. Usually you'd face further tests to confirm your fitness for duty. But these are exceptional times. Prepare for deployment to Pacific City. Looks like they've organized a welcoming committee. I'm sure you can carve your way through that roadblock, but right now you're needed elsewhere. Sit tight. I'm scrambling air support. Get used to getting shot at. This is all the welcome we get from Cell, the most dangerous gang Pacific City has ever seen. Cell are fanatical, ruthless, and organized, making them a force to be reckoned with. Cell have established strongholds at key locations across the city. They've fortified their positions with whatever they can lay their hands on, even hijacking and adapting agency tech. It may look like shit, but it's effective. Cell isn't our biggest problem. Look at this place. When the freak virus bit into Pacific City, it spread like wildfire infecting civilians and mutating them into the brutal night-dwelling creatures below. The mix of Cell and Freaks has brought this city to its knees, but the agency has a rescue plan, the Sunburst Defense System. It was developed to wipe out every last Freak in the city and stop the spread of the virus. Cell have hampered Sunburst construction at every turn. They've sabotaged its power sources, absorption units like the one on the rooftop to your right, Without power. Beacons are all we have to stop the freaks. They're the result of years of research and development. And right now, the last working beacon prototype is in cell hands. The prototype has been back to a cell stronghold here at the docks. That's the beacon over there on that central platform. But it's way too dangerous to set down here.
We need you to break into the stronghold and clear the way for an airlift. It's vital that beacon prototype gets back into agency hands. Okay, let's get you acquainted with the Intel console. Congratulations on completing agent diagnostics. That's a notable achievement. This is the agency Intel console. Track of your objectives and access useful information. Let's get down to business. Cell operatives are heavily guarding the beacon prototype, which makes an airlift impossible. Tactical locations marked on your tracker. When that's done, air support will be able to get the prototype out of there in one piece. Looks like you could do with some help with this one. I'm requesting more agents to help you out. So you like to work alone, eh? Good for you. First, we need to secure the entrance to the docks. The tactical location is marked on your tracker. Do us proud. This is a standard issue Peacekeeper Cruiser. It'll get you from A to B, but don't expect to break any speed records. The tactical location is in sight. Enter it and request air support. Your first cell kill. Let's hope it's the first of many. This place is crawling with cell. Remove the threats marked on your tracker. Use your HUD and your tracker to identify cell threats. Then eliminate them so air support can scramble. That's the way. Wear them down. Competent performance agent, but the fat lady's not singing yet. Well done, agent. You've eliminated resistance in this area. Peacekeeper drop squads are on their way to secure this tactical location. Shoot an enemy's arm to stop them from returning fire. The dock's entrance is under agency control, but we still need you to clear the area around the beacon prototype. Good work. Now give the signal to request air support. Dead hostiles are a good source of firearms, explosives, and ammunition.
missiles like this are highly explosive agents. So be careful not to be within the blast radius when you shoot one. Your HUD shows how you are evolving according to your performance. The different colored markers emitting from dead enemies represent which skills are improving. are low on ammunition, agent. Find some more or try a different weapon. is on the raised central platform. There are gun turrets in the area, Agent. Get your hands on one of those and drop cell like flies. Gun turret locations are highlighted on your track. Remember, skills for kills, Agent. Skills for kills. Good work. Now give the signal to request air support. There are too many cell. Suppress the threats marked on your tracker. Use your HUD and your tracker to identify cell threats. Then eliminate them so air support can scramble. support to scramble. Another cell breathes their last agent. 
You've taken to lawbreaker control like a duck to water. Excellent. You smashed Cell's resistance. Air support's on its way to pick up the beacon prototype. You just reclaimed your first set of tactical locations. Enjoy your achievement. You've done us proud. Now that we have the prototype beacon, we can put Project Sunburst into action. When hanging from a ledge, use your powerful upper body strength to launch yourself upwards. This is an online orb. You can only collect one when teamed with at least one other agent. So if you want in, you'd better find yourself a partner. Taking control of this stronghold means we can establish a landing zone for agency air support. As an extra test of your agility, we've let renegade agility orbs loose in Pacific City. Collect these for a major boost to your agility skills. Be warned, these suckers move fast. To really put your driving skills to the test, we've unleashed renegade driving orbs into Pacific City. Everyone you steer a vehicle into will give you a serious driving skill boost. Good luck. You just collected your first agility orb. That's an achievement. Ascending the heights to acquire agility orbs is the most effective way to develop your athleticism. The sunburst defense system is a revolution in freak control. Essential energy from sunlight is harnessed and processed by absorption units, then channeled through beacon detonations to fry the freaks. Cell have targeted the absorption units, deactivating them one by one so the beacons are useless. Your new objective agent is to reactivate the absorption units marked on your tracker to power the first beacon detonation. Cell will do anything to stop you, Agent, so stay sharp. The first absorption unit you need to locate is marked on your tracker. Agent, head for the absorption unit marked on your tracker.
Driving renegade orbs are tracked in the agency intel console. You'd do well to catch them all. This orb's no use to you unless you're in a vehicle, Agent. <laughs>